without more money, this type of preventative program might not last. It is tonight's top story. Good evening, everyone. I'm Kim Lund. For the time, effort, and money it takes to fight gang activity, many believe prevention is the best medicine. But government cuts are threatening a popular prevention program in Lancaster County. We say from Lancaster County reporter Meredith Jorgensen explains how young county kids are fighting to keep it alive. This is not an impromptu concert with buckets and sticks. It's an organized event to keep kids out of trouble. It's called Drumming for Peace, and it's part of Heads Up Lancaster. The core of Heads Up is really empowering kids in, in areas of their passion. Like, if you like freestyle rap, we teach freestyle rap. It also teaches breakdancing. Founders say if county kids get caught up in learning how to do this, they likely won't seek out a gang. You're providing a positive alternative to gang membership, because right now, in Lancaster, gang membership is so prevalent. The problem, heads up, is running out of money. It was paid by the school district of Lancaster as an after-school program. A couple months ago, when we found out the state was cutting funds, we sort of had to make a choice. We had to choose abandon the students or volunteer all our time. Well, none of those are really feasible. There's no way we're walking away. Heidi Wirt used her own money to start Capoeira, a Brazilian martial art program. There's a sense of coolness about it, and there's a sense of streetwise grit about it, and yet there's deep, deep amount of respect and accountability. Some of these Capoeira students are not even aware they're part of an anti-gang initiative. It gets you into like dancing and fun. It helps you how to relax when you got a bad day. Heads Up is now a nonprofit program hoping to inspire kids and financial donors. If we can connect them with people who care in the community, then we can make a difference. In Lancaster County, Meredith Jorgensen, News 8. State. Well, the Lancaster County Gang Prevention Task Force has paid for a dozen studi students to study capoeira this summer. Heads Up is hoping to raise $25,000 by August 1st so it can continue the after-school program next school year. For more information, log on to our website, WGAL.com. Well, in Harrisburg, two teenagers have been charged with arson.